Hi there! In my last video I showed you an edited version of my first paragliding at Vasaya Bay. It makes it look pretty easy. Now it's time for the real story. Three failed takeoffs and landing away from my chosen spot was what really happened. During the flight I talked through what I'm doing so you can follow along. And of course I'm happy to hear your comments. Consider subscribing if you'd like to follow my future adventures too. Enjoy! Make sure you're running. Yep. And no SD error, please. Yeah. Good. Flying breeze coming. Okay, that's not bad. Start this. At the end of the video, I tell you a bit more about the access road to this spot. Just need a touch more. This might be good. bit more space this time I think. The terrain is very interesting. Lots of prickly bushes got hold of my risers. It definitely took a while to get them out. Sweating a little, but it's worth it. There's water in the harness. There'll be water when we land on a refreshing dive. There have been plenty of breezes, so I'm sure one will come again. Like now. Stuck a little bit. Okay. Let's try again. You know what? It must be forward launch. I'm still gonna wait for my gust. Suddenly I had a bright moment and I decide on a forward launch instead. Not much later yeah, the real yes. fun can begin. Right. Let's go. The second camera stopped recording. Luckily, they both restarted in flight. So, let's fly along here for a bit. Not that way, just this way. 
seeing how it is. Maybe a bit longer. are just awesome. <laughs> That's crazy. It's unreal. So awesome. So I think the wind is a bit westerly. So I'm just gonna head a little bit to the other angle of the slope to try and find some better lift. So far not that much lift just yet. A tiny bit here. Nice. Not bad. Good. Yoo-hoo! So yeah, I think in this area I should have better luck. And I have no idea whether the other GoPro is still running. That's the funniest thing you hear on takeoff. You hear beep, 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 beep. <laughs> Why? Why me? Come on, what is that about? So anyways, I stay here for a bit. And uh, try and get that GoPro going. Enjoy the view. So clips here beach that way ah, and finally a nice cool down I think the launch wasn't perfect accelerated a bit too slow I'm used to launching in much uh, stronger winds I think now it was super light so I had to do forward it worked but anyway I know that for next time I don't think there was much tension in the leading edge when I took off so there we are all right let's see what the other GoPro is doing for a sec. Maybe I can put this thing here. Let's just press the button. Okay. Okay, it should be recording. Hopefully it's recording. Awesome, awesome. Really amazing. <laughs> so I need to try and fly into wind a bit as well. I think I'm going with the wind right now. Oh, it's so cool. What a place. I love this. Yay. So the family, they left quite a while ago. You would think they're at the beach by now, but don't know. Still got some good speed here too. Amazing. Nice bit of sink over here. And after sink should come some lift usually. Let's see. I'm flying without a Vario. I normally do a go dune soaring. And it's very obvious to see if you're climbing or descending. Very obvious now as well. Hey, yeah, being picked up by something. Let's see. What a view. That's crazy. Crazy. something here. I might want to stay near here somewhere. Not bad. What a spot. Amazing. is gorgeous. I can hear the waves a little bit. And the 
try and extend you a little more. Super light though, so I'm thinking there's wind, and there's, there's lift everywhere. But uh, okay, yeah, something here. Yeah, yeah. Good. I can try to stay there for a while. This is nice. Up. Up. Yep. Definitely gained some. It's facing the wind, this one. Facing the sun. Would be strange if there was nothing here. And I can easily tell whether I'm rising or sinking as well. What an impressive cliff. Yep. Oh. figure of eight. still running that makes me happy and you're still running too and almost out of battery that's all right very cool <laughs> amazing yay one more climb look at that tree on top of that rock <laughs> what on earth is it So I'm gonna play it pretty safe. Let's head for the beach and see. There might be more climbs, who knows. And actually, yeah, this one is pretty good. see on the ocean the wind direction is far from ideal it's a very very side shore it's on shore but much from the west which is fine it's still a bit 
bit onshore, so I'm getting lift. But uh, yeah, imagine if you're here, if the wind comes from there, you can stay up as long as you like. Maybe the afternoon is better. Could be. Oh yeah. Obviously, depends on the day, right? I'm gonna shut up for a while. Enjoy the view. nice if I made it to the point that I agreed but I was too tempted to try and stay near the near the cliffs these are so amazing so now if I'm gonna reach that spot I don't know otherwise I'll land on the road very nearby it's probably the best option it's the other beach they'll be wondering where I am and stuff that's no good and there's a small ridge there might give me some I don't want to use the speed bar because I know I'll be dropping fast. So, and I like to extend the flight as well. Yeah, that doesn't really make sense. Using the speed bar would actually get me further into the headwind and maybe I would have made it to the beach. But at this point, it's too late for that. from the intended spot but also my safer. so amazing <sighs> love it so now it's time to go back home there is a nice paved road that leads to the top of the cliff near to where the takeoff is but then from the top of the cliff down to the beach it's more like a gravel track with quite a few bumps in it i definitely recommend using a 4x4 for this although as you can see here it can be done apparently with a regular car if you are careful and that's it for this video i hope you find it interesting or useful in which case definitely subscribe to the channel and then we'll see you soon bye